1 Corinthians chapter 2, verse 1, I am adamant that every person who wants to be a witness of Christ should have these four qualifications for witnessing. If they don't have these four qualifications, they should not witness of their faith. And I, brethren, when I came to you, came not with excellency of speech or of wisdom declaring to you the testimony of God. For I determined not to know anything among you except Jesus Christ and Him crucified. And I was with you in weakness and in fear and in much trembling. So there we have the four qualifications for being a witness of Christ. One, you should not have eloquency of speech. Two, you should have weakness. Three, you should have fear. And four, you should have much trembling. Now, do you qualify? <laughs> not ordinary trembling, but much trembling. And if you're sitting there saying, boy, I could never get up on a soapbox and preach in public. I couldn't approach strangers. I just wouldn't know what to say. I don't have the words. I'm really scared. Uh -huh. You have just qualified yourself as a witness of Christ. You've aligned yourself with Moses, Gideon, Jeremiah, and the Apostle Paul. But the key to the release of the fear of man is in verse 2. Paul says, For I determined not to know anything among you except Jesus Christ and Him crucified. If you and I can just determine, say, Okay, Lord, I don't know what to say. I am scared silly. I have weakness, fear, and much trembling. But I just determined to be a true and faithful witness. Then we're halfway there. We have the computer programmed at least in the right direction.